game. But yeah, so can you it do is done. Throw first? Game on. So there you go. Big, big prizes on the line for these two guys. Kenny Nyans has not won a game on the European Tour before. Dyson Parodi only ever plays in Gibraltar. And he's done all right here. Rob Malarkey's here to see if he can go on another little run. Mm. Well, I'm really glad to see that Dyson Parodi is still the wallflower that we uh, <laughs> have come to know and love. Understated as ever as he made his way onto the stage. 97. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I remember that run five years ago very well indeed when he came so close to uh, beating Michael Van Gogh and the crowd 100. clearly played their part that night and I think they might well, may well play their part again uh, this evening as well. He did qualify for this tournament two years ago. He did win his opening match 32. at the other venue, Victoria Stadium. And that was a good match as well. He trailed 5-2 against Cordecker and ended that day with the best finishing figures of the opening round, six from nine. 45. If he produces something similar here, I suspect uh, Kenny Nyans might just find his uh, work cut out uh, over the course of the next, what, 15 minutes or so. 59. Kenny Nyans going by the nickname The Believer nowadays. I have to say that was a new one sprung on me during the walk-on with our MC, Swissville. Seventy-four. Not sure what he's trying to achieve with that nickname. To be honest, it's 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 more of a. It's like neither one thing nor another. Anyway, eighty-three. Can he require one hundred and four? He's managed to get himself down to a one treble combo finish in the opening leg on his own throw. Okay, top stops. There's one of them. 84. Well, that would have given him reason Boston to believe. 128. And he's still in good shape here to take the opening leg anyway with double ten, unless Dyson Perodi can find a double ten of his own. 118. <laughs> We're going to get a lot of that as well. 20. Ooh, no score. Well, almost banging a the line there, those three. Dyson, you require 10. Right. I'm not sure whether I'm more excited about the potential winning double or the potential celebration. Oh, no score. You don't oh. celebrate them. Can you, you require 20? Yeah, you may do a lot of walking around the stage tonight, uh, Dyson Parodi. Double five hey, is found by Kenny Nines. Accentuated point Dyson of the finger to acknowledge that. Slice of good fortune, I feel. Got there in the end. 24 darts required. 95. Well, there may be many adjectives you could use to describe this contest, but unpredictable will be one of them. Erratic 54. is going to be another, because you've got no idea what Dyson is going to do at the end of every visit, and quite frankly, I've got no idea what Kenny Nines is going to do in the middle of his visits. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I like it. I like it. Not everybody will, I appreciate. 85. Making the most of his day in the sun. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. One hundred miles. Quite sure what George makes of all this. Might just have to uh, remind Dyson about his timekeeping as well. Require 46. Well, after all that. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's 30. absolutely streets ahead in this leg. It would be one heck of a fight back if Nyans were to steal this one, but stranger things have happened. 60, Dyson, you require 60. All well and good posting the back-to-back -back 180s, Dyson, but can you find the double eight in the next two visits? He's getting closer. No score. And that's further away. And Kenny Nyans inches closer. Bounds closer. Storms closer. Dyson, you require Dyson 16. loses this leg. I will be in bits. Game oh. on the second leg, Dyson Burrow. <laughs> <laughs> it's what a piece, Dyson.
between Burnley, your darts. Kenny to throw first. Game on. I know they're both averaging in the 70s, but I'll tell you what. This could be one of the most entertaining games you see with a couple of 70s averages if he carries on like this. It, it doesn't look like they know what's at stake as well. That's the other thing. They're playing like it's a, a, an exhibition match at times. You know, there is a lot riding on this, as you pointed out at the start. And I'm just wondering if they've lost sight of that within the first two legs of its time. Has it ever been thus with Dyson? You know, even when he was on the verge of beating the undisputed greatest player on the planet at the time in Michael Van Gerwen five years ago. He was still 60. cavorting around the stage with gay abandon. <laughs> yeah, I genuinely don't think he cares. 60. You know, he's going to do what he does. Nines, by the way, we have seen on the European tour before, but not for a while, four years ago when he played in the 95. European Darts match play. Didn't go well, did it? No, it did not. He was beaten in the first round of that one. He's played another Euro Tour event as well. He lost in the first round of that one as well. 100. But uh, back with us, he's done bits and pieces. He won a Challenge Tour event fairly recently as well. 85. I mean, he's undoubtedly got talent, Kenny Nines, but you do, you do watch him play and his arms and legs going everywhere and shoulders going into stuff. There's... Yeah, there's a lot of 60. moving parts there. Yeah. Can you require it was the Dutch Darts Masters in 2015, I'm just uh, reminded of myself. 134. Yeah, really nice Sets himself up. Oh, hello. Oh, there could have been a lot more pressure. 81. Can you require 36? You show on the third leg, Kenny Nines. Well, more reassuring Dyson from to throw Kenny Nines. 24 darts to take the opening leg. That was just 18 darts, so he's moving in the right direction. 60. I don't think he wants or would have wanted another leg where it's drawn out and he's missing opportunities. Oh, that's a bounce out. That was a treble 20 as well. 80. Number two C Jose de Souza awaiting the winner of this one. He looked relaxed this morning, didn't he? he did. 100. Almost like a home game for him, this one, really. As, as close as he's going to get for the yeah. time 57. being. 57. <laughs> 31. Mm, he's got problems here, Dyson. Sixty. Back on track. One hundred and twenty-one. Just a little lazy with that last dart, straying off the straight and narrow. Would have been on a finish. Not going to matter on this occasion. That's the forty-four. All those moving parts we talked about. Kenny Nines having these sort of lungy darts and jerky darts. I think you are going to see him. When he does miss, he can miss by a distance. 99. The second player nicknamed Dynamite we've seen in action today. It all yeah. got going with a less than explosive performance. Wow, look at this. Barry. What is going on? 55. Dyson, you require 90. He was a good three feet away from the hockey there. But he was in line. Did he need to I be that I don't think he wise? needed to. I was looking at that again. I don't think he needed to be that far over. It wasn't as if it was totally restrictive. But Kenny knows better than me. He's on the stage. I, 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 it just seemed very... 140. I was require 52. He was in control of this leg. And it has slipped away from him here. And he requires 65. And it's mainly his own fault. Where's that gone? Single 9, single 16, tops. 25. Very ploddy leg, right, this one. 20. 21 darts apiece. Parodi's down to double 10. Nines is down to tops. Could be a pivotal moment, this one. No I score. Mean, that is so far Can away from the one 40. segment. It is untrue. I mean, the first dart was loose. The second dart was just 
careless. He's on the fourth and line, Kenny Knight. pounced all over that, and he's got the break, and he leads 3-1. And, yeah, it's all a little bit subdued now, isn't it? He was bossing that leg. And then consecutive Kenny visits to the 38, 32, and then that shocking attempt to take out 20, where he hit the big 15 and then almost treble 20. I've got to say, Dan, 61. I do not think that Jose de Sousa will be having a sleepless night over the prospects of facing either of these because Nyan's OK leads 3-1, but the three legs he's won, he has needed. 100. 66 for the eight. Yeah, 66 darts. Well, quite. And we all like watching Dyson Perodi muck about and celebrate his stuff, but if, if you're only scoring... 38-32 and busted his score. You haven't got much to celebrate. Yeah, and I've got to say, Ooh, those back to back 180s seem like a long time ago now for Dyson mm. Perodi. He's had to rein it all in, and there we see the averages. 72 plays 70 at the moment. 180! Second 180 for Nyan. I mean, in his previous Euro Tour appearances, he has averaged in the 80s. 96. His first one, he was, he was just shy of 90. Statistically, this is this is poor yeah. from Nayans. But he finds himself 3-1 up, and ironically, he could be on his way to his first ever Euro Tour victory. On the back of a 72 average. 47. But there you go, that's a, a debate for, well, I'm sure a debate that will continue, but a, a debate for another day, nevertheless. 100. And you require 153. And again, it is more than likely that one of these two is going to be making their way to one of the major tournaments of the year at the European Championship because of the way things have been structured this year for him. 47. I think you require 160. Yeah, just one or two isolated shouts in the crowd there that uh, George Noble's been alerted to. Single five for Dice. That just about sums up what he's been doing over the last... Three legs. Well, and he require 106. I would very much enjoy it if Dyson Parodi asked for the best of order, please. Quite frankly, we're playing darts here. Could you all calm down? Double 16. 90. Dyson, you require 79. 13s or 19s? Where's he looking? Okay. Tops it is. 39. Gave it a chance. Can you require 16? But are his chances fading? Moving around the board. He's he finds double two. And the believer may just be starting to believe that he's on his way Sifle through. Dyson and he's on the verge. And closing on. in on a first ever win on the European tour. Nineteen. I'm just wondering, Dyson, he's obviously a guy who thrives off adrenaline. 25. You know, big celebrations and everything. Gets him going, and, and that's when we've seen him play his better stuff. But unfortunately, 140. he's got worse, he's got flatter, he's had nothing to get fired up about, and the performance is not getting any better, although maybe Kenny might G him up a little. Well, they started off with a 19 and a 25 between them, then a 140 and a 180. 81. Fifty-four. That single 20 bed has taken a bit of a battering tonight as well. 69. It's an absolutely perfect first start from Kenny oh, Douglas. Oh, Despite looking like he might dislocate his own arm by like throwing him. Astonishing. 140. You're going to require 62. Well, this really would break the resistance of Dyson Perone. Dyson, you require 52. But at least Dyson is there to punish, or at least theoretically. Can he punish? Can he? Yes, he can. Finally, a bit of a spark from the Gibraltarian. 
Seven flag Kenny to throw first. Game on. And this time he did not stray into the single 15 better as he did before. And it's, well, no reason to two. get the crowd going once again. get back in that mode of play that we have seen before 43 well, Kenny Nines is there for the take 100 somebody if somebody just drags their average up into the mid 80s they could just waltz their way to this game I was going to make the point earlier that Nyans looks the more likely to produce a big score when he needs one, but uh, I think he's lost his way again. They, they both look equally 60. likely to chuck a, a 140 or a 28, don't they? Yeah. It's so difficult to weigh up exactly how this match is going to play out because they are both consistently inconsistent. That's, 82. That's the this should be Dyson's leg and then very much game on. If he can get his tail up and start playing with 60. a bit of confidence, we know what he can do. But we thought that early on in the game, and then it just evaporated, and it looked like he was going to slump to a 6-1 defeat. Well, I think Dyson, in the back of his mind, must be furious that Nines has got four legs on the board, given the number of darts that he's needed 90, to get those seven. legs as well. Nice in your corner. I mean, Kenny's missed 14, totally, darts, Dyson's missed 12. Totally preventable. 78. Can he record looking for a big treble? Does pick one up, and this would be for a break of throw as well to 42. really get back on terms. Nice and you require 63. Twenty-three. Can he require one hundred and two? What's Kenny think about this? Ten or a six. Six it is. Sixty six. Some way wide of the double eighteen. I've got yeah. no idea whether he was going for that six. He might have been just going ten or six. Yeah, I mean it hedges he bets, doesn't it? I think I mean he went for the double eighteen before, so I'd, I'd give him the benefit of the doubt with that one. Double ten again though for Parodi here. And this time he's inside for double five. Thirty five. Once again he's crestfallen. Can he require thirty six? Well, that's another Eight visit leg potentially here. We've had a couple of them already. <sighs> Nowhere near. Miles away. Closer. Oh, Closer sure. still. I genuinely don't know how he glanced off that barrel and it didn't go in. Dyson, you require hugely five. unfortunate. And once again, he could win a leg in excess of 24 no dots. Scores. And he's bust his. Where, where was that going? For the that second was... time. He has nearly hit treble 20 looking for a big one. That's a similar position to the first start last time. Double nine for 5 2. 18. And he has now thrown 27 nice darts. In this leg. A reminder five. one of these two probably goes to the European Championship. That's Is it like this it. man? Well, that was. Draw two lines in the single one bed. That's probably bang in the middle. Double two. Upstairs for double one. No score. Kenny, you require a Well, not only does it give Kenny Nines more chances, I'm worried for Dyson, he's got to find that big one again if he's allowed back to the board. Yeah. There's every chance he is, but there's also a chance he smashes one just above the treble 20 again when he comes back. Let's see. Splits it. Nearly busts just it. Just about, my word. My word. What a game. <laughs> Checking with... If, if, it was, if it was in the treble 10, he'd have called it. No score. Double four, 29 <laughs> dart <laughs> leg for Kenny Nyans to go with the 24 darters and the 21 darter that went before it. And that hey, could be that for Dyson Perodi. First. Game on. I love this game. I'm not sure either of these two do right now. <laughs> 43. The best leg of darts we've had in this match was leg two, which was running 17 darts. It's featured back to back 90s <laughs> from Dyson Parodi. Since then, he's nearly hit a couple of treble 20s when he's only wanted a big one. 85. He has missed 18 darts at double. Absolutely.
absolute madness here at Europa Point. Look at that. I mean, we could be on for the lowest winning average ever seen on the European Tour. In fact, we can probably 52. find that out for you. <laughs> 81. Fifty-eight. I think they call it winning ugly. But a win would be priceless for well either of these two. But it looks as though it's Nyans who's the more likely 54. of the pair. Well, you say priceless. I could put an exact price on it: <laughs> seven thousand pounds minimum, with a potential six hundred percent increase on that. <laughs> Eighty. The thing is, look, we know. Look, if Kenny goes on and wins this. We know Kenny's got loads better than this. This has been a, a very poor performance from him. But 98. If he goes and plays his normal game tomorrow against Jose de Sousa, a game which he'll have a completely different mm. mindset for. Yeah. You know, where he's not expected to go out and win it. 60. Dyson, you require 140. 96. It could be very different. 96. Can you require 160? Well, this will be a nice way to finish things off, but it's not going to happen. And Parodi's looking at 44 for a hold of 22 throw. dies, and you require 44. Could this be the start of the fight back? Double 16 for Dyson. 12. Kenny, you require 68. Tops. 48. Dyson, you require 32. So we're into the 20 something darts once again. Parodi looking at double 16. Lyons looking at double 10. Yeah, sure, he yeah, doesn't. Dyson Parodi. Yeah, Parodi, well, I'm not quite sure what that right reaction play, means, but Kenny on we go, 5 3. It is, I would imagine it's even Dyson Parodi, the black belt 100. ninja, undisputed master of the potentially unnecessary celebration. <laughs> even he. Would find it difficult to give it, give it. Four hundred and forty. When you're averaging seventy, <laughs> <laughs> just won a twenty-two dart leg. I've lost a twenty-nine dart leg the leg before. Yeah. Forty. Well, look, we have seen some winning averages on the European Tour in the past in the low seventies, but this is on to surpass them all. Forty-five. The lowest I can find a record is here at the Gibraltar Darts Trophy a couple of years ago, and David Francis. Be the great Robert Thornton 6 4 with a 72 average. So here we go, stats fans. Let's see if we can beat that. <laughs> Kenny just taking a moment with this third dart. 31. After those uh, first two, registering 12 in the process. 60. The thing is, there's life in this game because it doesn't look like. You know, Whatever position any of them finds themselves in, you're not convinced that the winning double is going to hit. No. If somebody gets 250 points ahead in a leg, you're not convinced that, wow, well, they've got this one sewn up. 39. I have a feeling this is going to go 6 5. <laughs> so many of those first darts oh, for Kenny that, Nyans yeah. have been up towards the double rather than the triple. 40. And it's got to be all built into that throw, which is it's just got so much unpredictable, lurchy... 43. ...jerky madness going on. And yet, sometimes he can do that. Ooh, 83. So where was that going? Because once again, he was almost bent double as he released that one. 96. Kenny, you require 147. Be a mad end to a mad game. Not going to happen right now, though. 45. Dyson, you require check out 78. 52 from uh, Dyson Parodi in the sixth leg. Tops again is the target. And and this time, Dyson Parodi Dyson finds a way Brody. through and. The smile is starting to come back to the face of Dyson Brody, and the belief is there amongst the fans as well. And George Noble must be fearing the worst because I, I'm convinced Ten this play, is going to Dyson win. Dyson to throw first.
game on. George Noble called 41 legs this afternoon. While Kirk Bevins, our other ref, only did... 27. 27. <laughs> 53. <laughs> and this evening, so maybe far. starting in similar fashion for yeah, Pear Funf Funf Noble. 134. <laughs> 60. Ninety-five. One hundred and twenty-five. Oh, this is a good leg from Kenny. Could go ball. Yeah, One hundred and five. Use of the board, and I think that might be the first time in this entire match that somebody's got down to a finish after three visits. Yeah, it is. Ninety-six. Can you recall it's reassuring that he's thinking clearly as well. And here we go. Can we see the big finish to round things off? It would be astonishing, but it's not going to happen now. 94. Although Parodi has a chance. 167. 167. He's going to pressure him. Go 16s, you can stay in the 20s. Oh, oh, 139. Just Can you 73. But he's there waiting to pounce. 21 off, leaves 52. That leaves 32. And that yeah. leaves nothing sure. at all. Kenny Lyons, look Kenny at the Nyan. celebration. An absolute battle between these two as Kenny Lyons wins it with a 70 average. It's the lowest we've seen on the Euro.